Please. All right, that one wasn't that bad. Well, thank you. those goblins with swiftness or patience you'll have to wait and see you rocks to roll boy that is your name right boy thank the shining stars where did you learn to shoot like that now i'm not a native goblin tongue but i'm pretty sure i made out the words unicorns and majestic museum mr fancy cakes is too barbarous for a caged life listen i want to sincerely apologize for my pilfering sausages and thank you for saving me i have been through too much already today i forgive you and I just want to say... Uh, yeah, 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 that's sweet boy, real nice of you. And since we are all square, I have a favor to ask of you. Can you deliver this rare and miraculous ingredient to that amateur magic shop in town? It's a snoozing leaf. Be careful transporting it, though. Once Mr. Fancy Cakes ate one of these snoozing leaves and was knocked out cold for days. And as a token of my appreciation, here is your money back. There you go. I'd give you more, but those hoarding goblins looted my cart. Well, gotta run. Good thing these shorts breathe so well. Thanks again, boy! I won't forget this! Sudanararia! Did the merchant remember that? Ha! <laughs> the merchant immediately forgot that.
is finally here. Well, part of it anyway. Chester, remind me to leave a poor review for that merchant on the town board. Ah, this should do the trick. Mmm. It's close, but it still needs that frog's breath. Well, I'm glad I could help further it along. Yes, and as a token of our appreciation, we would like to give you this, this, um, this? This vial of hypnotic powder. Oh, it's expired. It can work. It was just never finished. Let me guess. It's missing lollipop root or baby's tears. I can bring you a tub to Mr. Fancy Cakes for... Nope. It just needs raisins. Here. Thanks, I guess. Graham, a little squirrel told me the news. Oh, I'm deeply sorry you lost a friend. I'm here to help. Oh, is Chester up to no good again? How can I help? Good day. Don't desert me! <laughs> there was absolutely nothing you could do, Graham. Achaka would have met the same fate with or without you. You are the only adventurer to have ever survived that well. That despicable dragon has murdered countless knights, and you are the only one to have wounded him. Achaka's spirit lives on inside you. Let his arrow guide you through the rest of this competition. It's no consolation, but I want you to be my apprentice next spring. Perhaps we can avenge Achaka's death together. I'm not so sure about this. I think I need to find another path. Your story's not yet written, Graham. This is only the beginning. Find your path. Even if it leads you right back to where you started. Hello. Bye. Fortune favors the bold, and Amaya favors the fortune. all the rap so figure it out try to get Pilar's horn I went through too much for that eye to just give it away like that. That needs to be used on raisins. Otherwise, you're just wasting it.
I went through too much. That needs to be used on raisins. Otherwise, you're just wasting. Imagine. No. I think I'll keep this. Strange. 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 Did I ever tell you about the time I tried to catch a frog? It was riveting. <laughs> Grandpa. West, Tournament Theater, North Town Square, South, Under Development, coming next spring. That needs to be used on raisins. Otherwise, you're just wasting it. I went through too much for that eye to just give you hope. That didn't need a bell. It's a good thing we're auditioning potential knights. That moat monster is causing some serious problems. Have you seen the latest crop? I don't know if they have what it takes. They could always catch up by taking extra night school. Oh, that's a good point. Night classes made a huge difference for me. Caution. Bees and distress 